my dear Blade, do you think you're the only one who wants revenge for what he's suffered? Huh? Our stories are not so different, yours and mine. Hey, Dad. Dad, dinner's ready. Hello? Hey, Earth to Dr. Frost. Dad? Come on, I made us dinner. Okay. It's gonna get cold. Yeah, I'll be right there. Yeah, well, preferably sometime before it fossilizes. Come on, you can take a break from your research. You gotta eat. We should spend more time together. Isn't that what you've been telling me? Now that Mom's gone? No time like the present, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, how is it? Delicious. <laughs> oh, yeah. I got my test scores. I did well. College, here I come. That's great. I expect no less of you, Edgar. I'll be a doctor before you know it. And not just any kind of doctor. One like you. <sighs> Listen, son. It's not an easy life. It's a lot of hard work. And it can be lonely. I think I can handle it. Hmm? All I want is to get good enough so that someday I can help my father with his research. I'm so proud. <sighs> <laughs> so be it. Edgar had always known how to apply himself, but I'd never seen him work so hard as he did over those next few years. And it paid off. My God, how it paid off. He astonished me sometimes with the breadth of his talent and intellect. And I wasn't alone. Congratulations, Edgar. Hey, Dad. You did it. I still can't quite believe it. Did they really just give me a research grant? <laughs> you deserve it, son. And this is just the beginning. Your mother would be so proud of you. I hope so. Thanks, Dad. He had such potential. He would have been even better than I was. A better doctor, a better man. I'm home. Why are all the lights out? Edgar? Oh, he's made dinner, lovely. I'm sorry I'm late. Lost track of the time. Wake up! Edgar! Edgar! 